Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a mommy and daughter summer favorites video and it's in a collaboration video with my fellow mama here on YouTube. Her name is Chelsea and I recently discovered her channel here and if you are coming from her channel, hello, nice to see you. I hope you stick around for more videos. If you want to be a part of my YouTube family, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell next to it and give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. I'm 28 years old, Swedish, and I moved to Spain three and a half years ago. I met my fiancé here and today we have a 15 months old daughter, her name is Natalie, and she is our rainbow baby. Maybe you will see her <laughs> later on in the video, but for now I'm gonna do this myself because I have him watching her in the living room by now, so she will not be distracting me too much. But before we start, I want to tell you that the things I'm gonna show you is not necessarily summer things, but it's things that we have been loving this summer. And also Chelsea is doing her mommy and daughter favorites video over on her channel, so please head on over and check it out when you're done watching this. I will have her channel and her video linked down in the description box below. Now let's get started. First I'm gonna start with my baby things, the things that Natalie and I have been loving this summer for her. And because it has been really really warm and we have had trouble being outside as much as we would like, we have to find things to do inside. And now I find it where she's just in the age where she's discovering her love for books and that kind of things. So a couple of favorites are two books that I have. One is in uh, Spanish and it's called My First Words and the, the book has something is it has first a question and then she can flip this down and she get the answer and this is really good because it gets her interacting with the book and she can point at the different things and she can her favorite thing right now is to point at things and she wants me to tell her what it is and this book is in Spanish and we are trying to to read as much in Spanish and Swedish as possible so that's one of my favorites for her and her favorite this I think this book and this book is her two favorite books that she has in her collection right now. The second one is a Swedish book and it has this animal attached to it and it's like a finger puppet so you can interact more with the book and I think this is really good for learning and she, is, uh, she has the ritual now that depending on what page I am she will do different things with the book and in one of the pages it says that uh, this is my mama and my mommy lo mama loves me or something like that and she in that moment she she kissed the elephant and I think it's just so cute and she likes to point at the different images for example here she always point at the little um, what, what is the name? monkeys the little monkeys in the trees and she wants me to tell her in Spanish what's the name of that animal so that's two books that she has been loving and her daddy got her this uh, it looks like a book, it's like a mixture of a book and a tablet I would say, but for babies it makes noise. I'm not gonna <laughs> show you the noise now because I think it's gonna be quite annoying for you. But basically you can you can decide what volume you want here and when you turn the pages it's gonna give you different um, things to do. It gives you like questions or it repeats what it says in the images and that kind of things. And she has buttons all around the head of the lion and when she press them it gives her different songs or words or it's a very good learning um, activity play but she can do this when she's sitting down and normally I put her in her high chair when I'll be cooking or something like that and I need her to be sit down and entertained and then she used this a lot so this was a really good purchase and quickly here as well for when we do go out we like to go to the pool or we like to go to the beach and I want her to be protected so I bought her this swim suit in Decathlon and is um, it has the same protection as a 50 SPF and I like that it has long sleeves and well it's three quarter length sleeves and half leg but yeah, I really like it. It's really, really um, soft material. It looks comfortable on her. And I just like the colors as well. It's really cute. And she looks like a proper little surfer when she is using it. Now I can see that you have some lint on you. Anyway, 
and I like that it has a zipper in the back as well. It's really easy to open and to get her in and out of. And every time I pull this out, she knows what's gonna happen. She always gets super excited with that. And with that, when you go swimming, you need something to protect because she's still in diapers. And I have found my favorite brand of swimming diapers. And this is, here in Spain, we have a shop called Mercadona and I, I made a grocery haul from that store a few videos ago. Uh, maybe I will have it linked down below. If not, you can find it in my uh, history of videos quite recently. But we just buy the, the own, their own brand of, where is the brand? Here is the name of the brand that and is a size small so this is 6 to 11 kilos but I'm gonna show you what it looks like and the thing I like about this is that it has oh, I don't know how to say this uh, this elastic band in the waist and she's quite skinny in her waist so this really holds it in place and when you are done when she's done bathing it's really easy to take off as well. You just break it here on the legs like and you can pull it down. So really good swimming diapers. And uh, the two last things I have for a baby is one more thing for outside and it's a summer hat. This hat I bought her in the beginning of the summer. I got it from Primark. And I think I spent like five euros on this or six maybe, it was not so expensive. And it's the size six to 12 months. And I bought it because I, I had the illusion I wanted to make pictures of us matching with our hats. And I didn't expect her to like the hat, but now when Summer is here, every time she go out, she, she reached for this and she tries to put it on her head. And I just think that it's so cute to see her do that. And it matched very nicely with all her outfits as well. So that's favorite. And lastly, I have her new um, bottles. These are from the company Twist Shake. It's a Swedish brand. And this is a water bottle that I really, really like. I'm gonna show you the mouthpiece here. But and it's still wet, I just washed it. But here is the mouthpiece. And it's just really, really easy to clean. And it's really easy to take with. And I like the shape of it and it fits nicely in all the diaper bags and all of that kind of things and I like that it's white as you can tell maybe <laughs> yeah but um, they also have really good sippy cups and they have really nice normal bottles as well the only thing I didn't like too much from this company is their pacifiers but that's not because the pacifiers are not good it's because Natalie don't take pacifiers but all the products I have tried from them I genuinely really really like and if you are in the hunt for a good bottle or sippy cup I will have a discount code for you guys in my description box down and it will give you up to 60% depending on what collection you choose and I think it's a really good way of trying them out not having to spend too much money they're not super expensive but they are good quality and I really 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 recommend them <laughs> so yeah you can check it out if you want. I don't make any profit of you buying anything from there. The only thing that is that they reached out to me. They sent me a few samples of their products and I genuinely liked it. So I have a discount code for you if you want. Now to the exciting part of the mom favorites of the video. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I have a few beauty items. I have one um, item of outside and I will start with something I'm wearing. Recently I got this necklace. It's, it's just like a custom jewelry. It's not uh, real gold or anything. But I bought it in H&M and I really really love this design of jewelry. And I'm thinking about investing in a real one that looks like this. So if you have any shops or if you know anyone that sells this kind of jewelry but real gold and less expensive if possible. <laughs> but if you know any, you can please give um, a shout out to that company or give me a comment down below so I know where to find it. I would greatly appreciate it. And my recent purchase that I really love is uh, something I bought when I bought this 
uh, in the same moment I bought myself a bikini and I showed this bikini in a vlog a couple of weeks ago I think and it's a really cute like balconette type of bra or top and uh, I would have liked a size bigger but this it just looks really really fresh and cute now it's summertime we still have really really hot weather here so the only thing we can do really when we go out is to to be swimming but yeah I really like this because it's it stays in place and I can move around I don't have to be scared that anything is gonna pop out if you know what I mean and I don't really have to care about it to be nursing friendly anymore because we only nurse maybe in the morning or at night sometimes but also the pants I want to show you because they are super flattering is they are not so high I originally wanted a pair of bikini bottoms that was really high because I feel unconscious about my stomach area after having a baby but uh, yeah this is like a nice middle ground and I really like the hemming on this as well they are very flattering on and uh, nothing is digging in anywhere you don't want it to so that's good um, next is I would say a beauty item is a perfume or uh, maybe not a perfume is actually a mist yeah it's a flourishing bed and body mist but I use it like a perfume and it's from the company rituals and I got this actually as a Christmas present but I just recently started using it and I really 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 love this fragrance it's so fresh and really light and floral and that's not really what I used to wear before but now I, I don't want to wear anything else so if you have a ritual store next or near you, you I highly recommend to check this one out it's really 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 good and it's not overpowering I don't really want to have real perfumes now because I want Natalie to be able to smell me more yeah next mm, now I realized I forgot to put my lipstick on mistake anyway um, next is um, what it's called not beauty I'm thinking of I can't find my words now it's like grooming no not grooming Anyway, it's a deodorant. It's a deodorant stick and it's all natural aloe vera deodorant stick and is my absolute favorite. I have tried, I want to say like 20, 30 different kinds of deodorant in my life and so far this is the only one that works for me. Normally I always get like itchy under my arms and I don't like to feel like I'm always walking around like this and looking like a monkey but this one is is super nice it doesn't leave me any feeling of itchiness and I don't smell bad and it's all natural and I really really like it and this lasts me for about one year when I open it so that's a plus I think it's not more than like 10 euros or something maybe 12 and that's a really 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 good good deodorant lastly my lip combination that I have been loving this summer is my 8 hour cream from Elizabeth Arden I always put this at night or in the morning or before I put my lipstick on to give it a nice moisture and sensation and I showed this in my skincare routine video that I will have linked down below um, how oh, I'm sorry how I use it and last Millie my uh, lip combination that I have been loving is the Kiko Milan brand and it's a lip pencil in the shade 301 I will put it on for you because that was the idea from the beginning I just love this combination now I cannot see properly hmm I don't even know if it's going on <laughs> I think it does I can hear Caesar outside entertaining Natalie basically I put it all over and I end up with the creamy lipstick in the shade 104 from Kiko Milan and here 
really cute packaging as well and I like that they put their initials in the bottom it's really pretty sorry for my nails they're really outgrown I need to fix them with emergency ah. and there you have it my lip combination and it's the color I have been wearing all summer long and I love it even just with brows no makeup and this I hands down my favorite <laughs> so yeah that's my and my daughter's favorite from this summer months and I'm super excited heading into fall I can't really imagine fall coming because it's so freaking hot here we have about 34 degrees celsius in a good day and that's too hot for me <laughs> so i'm welcoming the autumn this year i really want autumn to come and i'm excited for the new fall fashion and uh, yeah i can't wait to buy new fall clothes for me and natalie and i will be sharing all of that goodness in future videos and I also wanted to say that in my last video that I posted was a cleaning routine video and you guys really seem to like it. So if you want me to do more kinds of or more videos of that kind and this kind of videos, please give the video a thumbs up so I know what to look for. And also leave me down in the comments any suggestions of what you want to see. But now my video is ending and I really want to encourage you to head on over to Chelsea's, show her some love, give her a thumbs up on her video and subscribe to her channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!